This video is made possible by our loyal Patreon supporters. Visit patreon.com slash psychetruth. Hello everyone, Amber here with Love Body Health and Fitness Coaching. I'm bringing you guys a slim waist workout today. So we're really going to be targeting the abs and the lower back for this one and help you feel tight and toned all around that tummy area. get to it. I'm going to start by doing a bridge pose on my mat. You can do this on your carpet wherever you are. Lay down on your mat. Have that chest towards the sky. I want you to press through your feet. We're going to go into a bridge right here working on that lower back. Now we're going to add some abs to it by taking your right hand, reaching it towards your foot. We're going to do that on each side before lowering down. One lift here. Reach reach, keep it lifted, lower. Again, reach, reach. We're working on our core and our lower back at the same time. When you come up, make sure to squeeze the glutes if you really want that glute activation and lift that back up. So you're really toning the lower back. Come back up, touch, touch, squeeze, lower and lift. Touch, touch, squeeze, lower. Three more times. Touch, touch, squeeze, lower, and touch, touch, squeeze, lower. Last one. Breathe through it. Squeeze up here. Little pulses. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Come back down, relax for a moment. For this movement, we're going to be doing a bow with a thrust. So I'll show you what that looks like. We're gonna sit those hips back, reach our arms forward, expanding that back, expanding those muscles, and we're gonna come up, thrust our hips forward, really activating that lower back as well as the glutes, and we're coming back down. This will help that back feel nice and toned. It's all part of that nice slim weight. So if you're wearing the low cut bottoms, you're wearing a swimsuit, you're going to look nice and toned all around. So right here, I'm really thrusting. I can feel those lower back muscles squeezing and I'm sliding my hands forward. Come back up, really squeeze, pop those hips forward, pop the pelvis forward and breathe. We're just gonna be repeating this. Nice bow and move those hips forward. Lean back. If you have weight of any kind, feel free to add that in if you redo this workout. If you wanna make it a little more difficult, but this is fine right here. This is amazing for beginners. For someone who just wants to keep your body in shape at home. I've actually barely been working out and I've been able to maintain my body through diet alone. So if you need more help with that, I'll tell you how you can get that help from me at the end of this video. Let's do three more. Two. And one, walk it forward. Nice little stretch on the lower back and bring it back to center. Since we're gonna be on our knees again for this next one, I want to protect mine. I'm just gonna take the mat and fold it in half to give myself some extra cushion there. And with this one, we're gonna be in a quadruped position, tabletop on all fours. I want your hands below your shoulders and place those knees right below the hips. We're going to be extending our opposite arm, opposite leg out, like such. 
working on the lower back in this position, actually the upper back as well. We're gonna bring it down, and I want you, instead of just setting your knee down, bring that knee forward, and then extend. Bring your hand to meet the mat, drive that knee inward, and extend. Again, working on the abs while we work on the lower back at the same time. I love these functional movements, because not only are they fun, okay, well, they're fun to me, but <laughs> we hit two different areas at one time, so it saves me time and energy. Breathe through it. Focus on that crunch and extension. Bring that leg as far as you can behind you. Four, in, three, in, two, one. Okay, we're gonna switch. Now the left leg is, I mean, sorry, the left hand is extending and the right leg is extended behind us. Just like so, opposites. My hand meets the mat and I drive that knee inward. I bring that in towards the midline of my body when I do this. Take this as slow as you need to go. If you find that it's hard to balance moving that hand out, then just forget about the hand. Keep that leg moving out the entire time. But I want you to focus on your balance if you can try. So make sure that you're extending that hand out nice and slow. And if you wobble and you fall, that's okay. Breathe. Building some heat in the body here. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last one. I'm gonna roll those shoulders out. Made her burning a little bit from holding myself in that tabletop position. All right, I'm going to fully lengthen my mat because I'm going to be on my back doing a reverse crunch, normal crunch variation. So I like to switch workouts out, make them fun and interesting because who likes doing the same thing over and over again? I know I don't. <laughs> so I'm just gonna set my hands on my side and I'm gonna be bringing my knees in towards my face, lifting up that pelvis, moving and crunching in towards me. I'm extending it out and I'm taking my hands and crunching up. And we're just gonna go back and forth between the sequence. Reverse crunch to normal crunch. Make sure to breathe through it. Don't hold your breath. And crunch in. Bring those knees in towards you. And feet flat on the ground. Head up. And repeat. Those abs are burning, but that's okay. We're gonna push through it. Keep it up. And five, crunch. Four, crunch. Three, Last one. Sometimes air gets trapped between my hips and makes some noises there. It's kind of funny. Five, four, three, two, one. Lay back down and relax. Ooh, that core should be burning right now. We're gonna end this workout with what I call the opposite of a plank because instead of being on our forearms, we're actually going to be on our backs and we're just lifting our legs up, lifting the back up, and I'm holding my hands in front of me like such. If this is too hard, you can bring those knees in. If your lower back is hurting, tuck the pelvis and take some of the pressure off of that lower back and just lift your chest up towards your knees and hold like this. And we're keeping it 
right here. Breathe through it. Try not to look too far forward. Keep that head lifted, looking towards the ceiling. And breathe. Nice deep breaths right here. We're gonna hold this. Again, if you can do this, then do this. <laughs> this is a variation. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, we're going to pulse it here, 3, 2, 1, you are done with today's workout, amazing job. So this can be a circuit that you can repeat multiple times, so if you feel like you need more of a burn, like I probably do, I'm going to repeat this twice in a row, but you've had enough with this workout today. That is amazing. One time can definitely give you a great workout. If you want to see more of my videos, then make sure to check out the lower belly workouts that I have on the channel, inner thigh workouts. I pretty much hit every kind of muscle part you can think of. So you can even combine another 10 minute workout with this one. And if you want to get to know about me and my one-on-one -on -one coaching services, head on over to lovebodycoaching.com. I would love to see you over there and make sure to subscribe to my email list. I can tell you about my special offers when they come out. I had such a fun time working out with you today. Please leave a comment below on what your favorite exercise in this workout was. I would love to hear about it. And of course, if you have any suggestions on future workouts, please let me know. I will respond to your comments. Have a wonderful day, guys, and I will see you in my very next video. Be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. And if you haven't already, follow us on social media for tips, tutorials, giveaways, and daily inspiration. This video is brought to you by our loyal patrons who help to keep our cameras rolling. To show our appreciation, we produce tons of exclusive content just for our patrons. Wellness Plus is available on Amazon, which you can stream from your home on your phone, tablet, or TV. Join Wellness Plus today and get your first seven days free. Join us for 14 and 30 day programs, hour long classes, and much more on our yoga app, Yoga Plus by Psyche Truth. It's free to download and features a variety of wellness content, including yoga, fitness, Pilates, guided meditations, and interviews with dozens of wellness experts. Start your 14-day free trial today by clicking the link below.